Hey guys, Erin here with another episode of A Little Bit of Everything with Erin. Today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to accurately resize a letter or an image. This was actually a question that came up on one of my videos suggesting to do this. So sometimes you will get a letter and when you type it out and you look at the size, it tells you like right now this one is eight and a half by five. Well, it's not really when you cut it out, it won't be accurate because of this giant gap that's all around the letter. So the first thing you wanna do to fix that is you wanna right click and hit convert to path. Now please understand that if you wrote out a full word like Aaron and you did that, you will not be able to change it back with the fonts because you've made it go from a font to an image and you won't be able to retype. So you would have to start all over. So make sure when you do that, that you're completely done with typing. But now you can see that we have a more accurate width and height of this letter. It's now saying it's 5.4 by 4.8 instead of 8.5 by 5. Now, if you want this to be a certain size, you would go over here to your transform panel on the right, click that, and at the top you'll go to Reese or scale, and we'll click that. And then down here, make sure that your lock is unlocked like mine is. And now you can just type in whatever height and width that you want, and then hit apply and it will accurately make that an eight by five. And you can do this with images as well. It just makes it more accurate so that you're not sitting there trying to measure it out slowly and get it where you want it. I hope that helps. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a like. Go ahead and share that if you want. That helps me out. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, and if you hit the bell at the top of the page, you'll get notifications anytime I post new videos. If you have a suggestion for a video I should make to help you out, you can leave me a comment down below. I do uh, take those into consideration. As always, guys, happy crafting!